What is going on guys? My name is George or the Real Wolfie and welcome to the second TM Tips and Tricks episode. I know I've already released one of these, I think it was on Sunday, but I deleted that video as I found a bit of an easier way of installing the additional features on the Trophy Manager. So in this episode, I'm just going to show you a few downloads you could do for Trophy Manager which really help you out and they're a bit easier way than the last time so even if you've installed them stick around because I'm going to show you one new download that I didn't show you in the last episode and also show you how to de uh, delete scripts if you don't want them so remember that this series is inspired by Bones FC because he has done a forum called so, uh, simple help advices info for newbies on trade for manager and as you can see there are loads of links with loads of different subjects that are all really helpful so go and check that out there'll be a link to it in the description uh, it's just really really helpful for you uh, if you are a fairly new team or you just need a bit of info but in today's episode of TN tips and tricks I'm going to show you how to install rating R2 which is now actually rating R3 there has been a recent update at the start of season 45 which has uh, upgraded that also trophy buddy and my match analyzer so let's get on with this and first off how to install rating R2 first thing you want to do is log on to your trophy manager account and you'll be presented with the home page as always then you want to go to the forum which you can do by clicking on this globe icon and then clicking on forum and that'll take you to the forum of the country your team plays in so for me it is england then on the english forum page you'll see here here is bones's advice guide and we will click on that i'm not sure if it works the same for international teams outside of england but if not, there is a link in this video to Bones' help forum. And once you've got there, you want to click on post 2, which as you can see it says is about rating R2. Now you go on this and it'll give you a few nice pictures of what uh, Bones' clubhouse, goalkeeper and outfield pa uh, player pages look like once you've installed Trophy Buddy and rating R2. But we don't want to bother with that. We want to look down here at these two links. Both are about info on Trophy Buddy and rating R2 tool setup, but the top one is English teams only and the bottom one is for international teams. So click on the one that set relates to you the best, obviously for me it's the English one. And here you're presented with the page about installing Tampa Monkey. So we click on this link and it'll take us to a page that looks like this which shows up Tampa Monkey. But make sure before you do this, you look at the picture which comes up with it. So this just tells you which one to install because there are a lot of Tampa Monkeys. And as you can see, it says click on this one with just the one that says Tampa Monkey. Now, this picture with the black square with circles cut out doesn't always come up. I think it's never come up for me, but you'll recognise it when you click on it. And you know it's not Tampa Monkey Beta, which has the red icon, or clip, co uh, clip copy for Tampa Monkey. It's a bit of a tongue twister. But let's go back to the page, click on Tampa Monkey installment, which, as I said, takes you to the uh, Chrome Web Store. And then you scroll down, and as you can see, we have Tampa Monkey Beta here. If you click on this Tampa Monkey, you see it has the black square with circles cut out. Now you just click Add to Chrome, Add Extension, and that is Tampa Monkey installed. And you'll see when you're on this page, there it is. It says Tampa Monkey has been added to Chrome. You can see the black icon there. And it just gives you a bit of info about Chrome here. Yeah, so you can read through that if you want but that's basically how to install Tamp Monkey and then we can get on with installing Rating R2 or the newer version Rating R3. The Tamp Monkey is installed we can go back to the Info and Trophy Buddy and Rating R2 tool setup page and if you're wanting the older version it does say latest version but this was published in 2014 but if you want the older version you can click on this link and it will take you to Chrome extension page and you just click install. But as I'm not wanting the older version I go elsewhere. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to open up a new, a new tab because we will need to go back to the forum page later. 
and I'm going to go on to my messages because Bones FC has sent me a link to a website called Greasy Fork where you can get it, uh, get rating R3 easily. So there is another website which looks like this, which is a Danish website, but I've not been able to download it from that. You just click the link and apparently it it sends a little pop-up download down here in the bottom left which you then just click on but that never seems to work for me so he sent me a link to a website called Greasy Fork and that's where you can download Rating R3 for Season 45 the English version so if you click install this script it will take you to another Tampa Monkey website so it's similar to the Rating R2 version where you literally just click install and then it's done. It will bring you back to this page which we can now swap back to Trophy Manager and as you can see when we get onto this page it doesn't look any different. That's because rating R3 only changes your uh, player pages. So if we look on Matt Turnbull, our left midfielder, now you see the difference. So we have all of this. This is a lot different to rating R2. You didn't have season training intensity, which is what TI stands for. You didn't have rating position. Uh, we have more stuff around here. We have recommendation in all positions. We have a lot more and a lot more in-depth things than we did with rating R2. But that is what it looks like um, for rating r2 once it's installed and as you can see here you can see it's installed if you click on here and it shows you rating r3 en season 45 has been installed so next up we are going to download trophy buddy i'm going to show you what it looks like with that as well now we want to go back to the forum page where we installed tampa monkey and we can see here there is Trophy Buddy V2.7 for Firefox and Chrome. It says to have all the nice shortcuts as shown from my club page, you can download the Trophy Buddy tool, which is also made public. So if we click on this link, it takes us to another forum page where there is a link to install Trophy Buddy V2.7. If we click on that, it takes us to another one of these pages, and literally we just simply click install. Now that is installed, we get loads up our home page now just to refresh it and there's Trophy Buddy. So we get links to current bids, our squad and reserve team if we have one, Tactics Youth Academy. Uh, we don't have higher coaches because that used to be available but now isn't. There's scouts and scout reports, there's also my scouts, there's players. There's everything you could need. There's also here, it takes you to your club, see your messages, uh, your league, cup, and log out. So it's just got a few more links which can come in really, really helpful. And yeah, that's how to install Trophy Buddy. And as you can see, if we click on this again, we have Trophy Buddy to, uh, V2.7. Finally, we are going to install My Match Analyzer, which is another one that I've got a link from uh, Bones by. Uh, messages so I'll put that link as well as the link to rating R3 in the description of this video and I'll also make a, a thread on the forum just so you have those links ready for you so you can go and use them but if we now go on to our messages quickly yeah and we'll be able to see if we just go on to here there'll be somewhere a link to install here we go so we have Install Trophy Buddy, things like that. We have Rating R3, we got a link to, but we've already done those. And now we have Chrome install for My Match Analyzer. Now, this is another Greasy Fork webs uh, website, so it's nice and easy to use. It's not at all hard, and my internet's playing up again. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to just cut ahead to when uh, Greasy Fork has actually loaded. And I'm ready to show you guys how to download it, just so you don't have to watch. A se oh, here we go. Now it works. So anyway, what you want to do, as we did with rating R3, is just click install this script. This will take you to another Tampa Monkey page, and you click install. And it's all lovely, lovely jubbly. We are done. And we can go back onto Trophy Manager now and onto a match page. So we've gone onto the page of our 2-1 win against Malvern Albion. You'll remember that game from last term weekly update. And as you can see, if we just click this, you can see there is my match analyzer. 
So if we just fast forward to the end of the game, you can see in this bottom left corner we have my match analyzer. If we click on analyze, it should bring up a match report, but randomly there's no match specified. So I'm not sure why this happens with me. It does happen quite a bit with mine, so I'll just have to check. Yeah, no script is running here, so I'm not sure quite what's gone on. So we're just going to have a look. And uh, no, nothing seems to be wrong with the actual installation itself. So it should be pretty much fine to go, but randomly it's not working for us. So if you guys know why that's happening, so if Bones is watching this or someone that knows a lot about my match analyzer, let me know down in the comments what I've done wrong there. But other than that, guys, that is how you install Trophy Buddy, Rating R3, and kind of my match analyzer. If you know what's gone wrong with that and uh, the last one, then let me know down in the comments. And yeah, my name's George or the Real Wolfie. And this has been another TM Tips and Tricks episode. I'm going to release another one quite soon about how to make a custom logo work for your team. So stick around for that. Stick around for some, uh, for some project cars, more F1, more trophy manager, more good stuff like that. I might do some FIFA sometime in the future. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video, guys. Like and subscribe if you, if you found this helpful. And yeah, I'll see you in the next video.